How's it going, everybody? This is Golden Bolt, and welcome back for some more Pokemon Gold. In the last episode, we caught ourselves a Swinub, our sixth and final team member. And we got here to the ice path of death and... Blah. And <laughs> in this episode, I uh, am actually going to speed through the rest of this, because as much as I like you guys like to see me suffer, this is not worth it. And basically, the, the rest of this dungeon is basically just ice puzzles. And... Uh, it's really, really repetitive. That uh, section back there is the real only, like, ice back and forth kind of thing you have to do. I mean, you gotta plot out, plan out what you're gonna keep doing, but it's really not worth me showing because it's really, really redundant. So, like we did in Pokemon Leaf Green, let's, uh, let's speed on through this. Also, I bought a ton of repels. So, see you guys at the end. was fun. JK. Does this girl even battle you? Well, you came through the ice path. You must be a hot shot trainer. Alright. Well, that sucked, and now you guys can see, you guys now see in fast motion how much I hate ice puzzles. Anyway, going here. And Dragonair is cute, but I don't have it. Do you have Dragonair? Want to trade it for my Rhydon? Now, um, Rhydon this this is this is not a good trade in my opinion mainly because Dragonair is so much better in every aspect uh it just it's, I just it's just not worth it anyway welcome to Blackthorn City ladies and gentlemen very very cool city uh, as always you know make stop the Pokemon Center because it's fun and uh yeah this is pretty awesome welcome to Blackthorn ladies and gents now, uh, I'm not sure how uh, long this episode is actually going to be, because I have to judge time based on um, that uh, speed up thing there. And, um, yeah, this place is pretty awesome. I always kind of liked Blackthorn uh, City. As you can see, we've already, the gym is open. There is no restraint here to the gym. Let's see what this guy has to say. Our gym leader is waiting for you. However, it would be impossible for a run-of-the-mill trainer to win. Well, that's good, because I'm not one. Now, I fully don't expect to challenge the gym leader in this episode. Um, oh, good, Repel's Effect wore off. Now, this is probably the most compl complicated gym out of all of them. Let's see what you have to say. 
Yo, champ in the making, it's been a long journey, but we are almost done, count on me. Claire uses the mythical and sacred dragon that Claire, hmm. Weak against ice type moves, that's good. This guy is totally required. Your first battle against dragons? I'll show you how tough they are. You do that, buddy, you do that. Again, this might be a shorter episode, judging on how fast I decide to speed things up. And cool, Trainer Paul is prematurely white hair. Speaking of which, um, I was severely depressed. I, s I wasn't even joking in my Emerald LP, which may have, uh, th that this may have been why so many people thought it was funny that I uh, kept saying that the character in my em in Pokemon Emerald had a, uh, he was prematurely old or had premature white hair. I literally thought, like to that day that he had white hair. I didn't know that was a hat. I'm like, what? I, I saw a picture of him and, a, and he, it was a hat. And apparently it's a hat. And that's super depressing. I was like, oh my god. So, all these years, I thought he was... Uh, I thought he had white hair. He was just wearing a weird sock cap, I guess. Alright, Ice Punch. Also, um, remember when I was talking about Waterfall? Apparently in this generation, Frogator can't learn it. Sorry about the cut there. Um, yeah, so that's that. If we can get some good experience with Shagadelic here. Maybe go up a few levels. It's cool that it's getting experience by not even being out there. <laughs> it's like that, the final battle in my Leaf Green LP, where, uh, Jolteon leveled up just by getting thrown out. <laughs> And the Pokemon, and whoever it was, Tyranitar or something. Or Arcanine. It was that freaking Arcanine, that's what it was. I like how he's just like, I'm disappointed. You know what, I'm disappointed in you also. I would speed this up, but I like this dungeon. Oh, hello. And there's, there's my girl. There she is. Uh, for some reason I liked her infinitely more than Jasmine. Infinitely more than any other female gym leader. Um, not sure why, but I just did. Oops, I pinned that guy in. Sorry, bro, good luck getting out. Actually, he still has a way of getting out. The boulder fell through, yay! Um, anything? Nope. Dead end. This girl is also required, clearly, because she's kind of just... We go through rigorous training under Claire. <laughs> oh, I bet you do. Alright, I'm, I'm seriously going to have to stop doing that. Cool trainer Fran. Fran Drasha. Cedra is awesome. Cedra is the evolution of, um, uh, the, the Horsey. Why couldn't I think of it? And Horsey, or Cedra, with, uh, being traded by holding the King's Rock, uh, evolves into the extremely powerful, and I love it so much, Kingdra, which is a water and dragon type. So, only has a weakness to dragon. That's it. I love it. It's so, 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 so good. Alright, I'm gonna try and get rid of this paralysis. Don't I have a paral paralysis heal? No? I have a full heal, though. I saw it. I was gonna say, maybe my mind's playing tricks on me? I don't like, uh, being paralyzed here with Hercules, of all people. Not cool game. Not at all. Alright. Come on now, Cedra. Cedra's when it starts to get really cool. For some reason, I think I think this evol Cedra's really overlooked. But I guess most middle of the road evolutions are. But I don't know. Cedra's really awesome. Just I don't know. Just the way it looks is really cool. And that would have been a ton of experience. Hey, look, Shagadella grew to level 22. That's what I like to see. And cool train of Fran. Ah, I'm so disgusted. That's a very bad Fran Drescher um, impression. Oops. Nice Weekend again. Yeah, I was uh, just tracking him to see if we had a chance of uh, chasing him at some point. Why'd I use a... Yes, I, yeah, now I'm definitely in the Hyper Potion era now because... Uh, had to use two Super Potions? Yeah. Uh, which one of these can we use? Well, as much as I love Strength Puzzles, looks like we're having to do this. Hopefully this is right. I hate strength puzzles. Oh, I don't hate strength puzzles. I hate ice puzzles. Ice puzzles suck. Strength puzzles don't suck as much. Because if you just if you just plan ahead, you'll be okay. You'll be all right. Um, we might as well do this as well while we're up here. It's not it's not as if we all use dragon type Pokemon. My policy is to use Pokemon that are stronger than dragon Pokemon. Good luck. Oh, you mean dragon? Um, 
water Pokemon like Kingdra. Oh no, he uses Horsey. Never mind, just a water Pokemon. Yep. Oh, I, I totally see your point now. I totally see it. Boulders in your face. It's not really a boulder, now that I look at it. I kept saying, like, I'm just gonna chuck a boulder in your face, but it's not- It's not really a boulder, it's just like a slab of rock. That's really all it is. And somehow it's a normal type move. That, that's, a, that's a rock type move, that's unacceptable. I really need to stop referencing other videos in my videos. <laughs> I'm sorry! And Seedra once again, as if we haven't seen enough of this. Hope you enjoy seeing it, because you're going to see it a lot. I would love, I would have loved to use, like, Seedra. That would have been cool on a, uh, on, like, my leaf green team. That would have been awesome. I don't know, though. What is? Come on. Mm. I'm planning on just getting to Claire, uh, in this episode. And Hercules is really just being a hero. No pun intended. Actually, intended. It's not really even a pun, it's just a bad joke. At which point, I apologize. Come on, Cedra. Going down, 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 to the bottom of the Cedra. You are special. <laughs> Alright, cool trainer Cody. Yeah, I'm special, man. Um, what these boulders are doing, by the way, they're uh, creating bridges for us to walk on down, walk uh, across some of the platforms down here. Like this. Oh, this chick. She's required. So as you can see, it's, in, it's really not that hard. Dragons are sacred Pokemon. They are full of life energy. If you're not serious, you won't be able to beat them. Well, let's see how serious I am right now and watch me beat them. Are you Fran again? Lola? I guess that kind of that kind of accent would kind of be appropriate because didn't Lolo Bunny from like Looney Tunes have a similar accent? I don't even know. Like I'm expecting an answer. How about a rock in your face? Uh, nah, man. There's such a big pause between the actual animation of paralysis and the actual happening. Uh, I think in the first generation, Dragon Rage was the only Dragon type move. Holy crap! My god. And, uh, it only did like 40. It was very stagnant damage. I'm pretty sure it was only 40. This is almost full restore level here. Dragon Air. Yeah, we might want to switch now. <laughs> Just might want to. Hello, Dragon Air. Dragon Air is the evolution of Dratini. Dratini, the, the Dragon Air, Dragon Air, Dragonite. I don't know why I said Dragon Air twice. Dragon Air, Dragonite, Dratini family is very hard to uh, train. Mainly because they uh, take a lot. Why do you keep thunder waving? Uh, I thought I was gonna have to wait for Claire to start doing this, but I guess you guys are in on it too. Cool. Also, yeah, dragons are super effective, or ice is super effective on dragon, so that's why I'm consistently using ice punch. If you couldn't tell. Oh, oh, all right, and Boshi grew to level 36. Hey, and Shagadella grew to level 23. Shagadelic's gone up a couple levels in this episode. Way to go! I don't know if that was sarcastic or not. But anyway, ladies and gents, we are here with the lovely, lovely Claire. Ah, yes. So many memories of this woman. Wink, wink. Okay, now I'm just getting creepy. I'm sorry! In the next episode, we'll be taking on Claire Wink again! Um... Yeah, that's what we'll be doing. So yeah, guys, uh, that's about it. So if you like this episode, go ahead and click the subscribe uh, button, give it a good thumbs up, and don't forget to check out my other videos if you like content like this. That was a really jumbly, jumbled ending. But yeah, guys, for me to you, have a very good day. And I see I keep doing it. It's have a very nice day, so have a very nice day. And I will see you guys next time.